All right, welcome to Pokemon Omega Ruby. As you can tell from what you saw um, at the beginning, this is the Japanese version. However, again, like Pokemon X and Y, there is an English uh, language part, uh, second option. So easy to start getting the game into the game immediately. Um, I will be right back in just a second, actually, just to check something, actually. Alright, so after looking into some things, first, I, ch I asked, like, I've been asking for the past week or so, should it be a boy or a girl in this playthrough? And the results for that are that most of you all want me to be a girl. So, which I actually have no problems with that, only because I prefer May over Brendan this time, actually, because by the fan art and stuff, and just something puts me off with Brendan. Brendan, eh, nothing like, nothing really talk about with Brendan. But the other thing that I asked was, should I do a Nuzlocke or not? And this actually came down to one vote, actually, and... <laughs> it was actually don't do a Nuzlocke to get to the a end game ASAP. And it was really close. And this one has actually less votes only because I don't know why. Some people wanted to vote for that one and the others didn't want to vote for this one right here. So, yeah, and that's why I tried to advertise this like, I think I advertised it like three times on YouTube and four or once on Twitter, so that's why I say check on Twitter. Um, but anyways, that's that. Enough with that. Um, and then also, I cannot do it now, but I mean, I'll even try it. I'll even try it now. I'll probably stop the recording when I get to the code. Oh, wait, I don't even think I can do it right this instant. Yeah, I gotta do... Did I just buy a bootleg of the game? They they pasted such a great intro and then... <laughs> Hi, sorry to keep you waiting. Welcome to the world of Pokemon in 2D. <laughs> Sucks to be you, Luke. You bought a bootleg. From the eShop, too. <laughs> Screw you, Game Freak. <laughs> My name is... Birch. But everyone calls me the Pokemon Professor. And this is what we call a Pokemon. This world is widely inhabited by creatures known as Pokemon. We humans live alongside Pokemon at times playing together as friends and help at times helping one another out. And sometimes we just like to have fun battling like us, but as close as we are, we don't know everything about Pokemon. In fact, there are still many, many mysteries surrounding Pokemon. I do research to try to unravel those Pokemon mysteries, but that's not enough for me. I'm going to get attacked now. <laughs> By a Taylor this time. Not a Poochian or a Zigzagoon. What about you? Are you a boy or girl? Well, that's funny. I feel like I'm playing uh, Fallout a little bit when the with the fact of you choose your stuff via a an actual little portable thing. But as what you're not gonna actually show boy or girl just pictures? Okay. Or no, you're not even going to have the dialogue. Okay, but, yeah. Will you give me your name, too? Um... Oh, I thought that was a big head on a little body. Um... 
I'll just go with the usual. Maybe I'll if I make May my uh, if I make my May my main I'll name her Luke too, just to get things straight. But right now, I'll be. Oh, I don't know. My main game's gonna be Alpha Sapphire, but this is gonna be my Japanese game. So, so you're LB? Yes. What's wrong with that? Oh, I see. We have 3D in, in little uh, gadgets now, by the way. <laughs> or wait, that's just a picture of you. You're using that camera that's on the top of your screen right there. You're that, LB! Actually, my name's Luke, but... Ah, you're the one who's moving to Little Root Town, where I live! Are you ready? Your very own adventure is about to unfold! Be courageous and leap into the world of Pokemon, where dreams, adventures, and friendship await. I expect we'll be meeting again soon. Come see me at my Pokemon lab. That text is too fast. I love how it goes so slow in the game. But auto scroll goes so fast. What, I can't even sneak on the bus? Well, one thing that hasn't changed with the 2D games to 3D, you have the that noise still. <laughs> it's an Azuril doll. It has a familiar smell. What? Why are you smelling things? The box is printed with a Pokemon logo, blah blah blah. Anything else? That's not a Oh, it's pointing at that box. What the heck's that green thing? And what's this? Nothing. Well, time to see what awaits in our new adventure. Which I'm pretty sure everyone's seen the leaks by now. <laughs> now I'm going to be going through this game very, very, like, for this weekend and try to be done with it this weekend. So keep that in mind. I'm going to be having uploads more than one. Uh, today, so keep that in mind, too. LB, you're here at last! I suck at women voices, but whatever. Wasn't it tough riding in the back of that bumpy moving truck all the way here? Well, this is Little Root Town. What do you think? This is going to be our new home. It has a quaint feel, but it, it looks like it should be a nice place to live, don't you think? So what you think? Shut up. And you get your own room this time, LB, while I sleep in... who knows where. At least that's what it was in the 2D games. <laughs> Come on, you have to see the inside! Hey, don't drag me in there with you! No! No! <laughs> yeah, where's your bed? See, LB? Isn't it n nice in here, too? Yeah, at least I get my own room, but where's... no, seriously, where's your bed? X and Y had a bed for the mom, but not this game still. The moving company's Pokemon even help with the unpacking and cleanup. They really make moving a cinch. Are you going to tell me to set my clock? Because we don't have a clock anymore. Or it's already integrated into the game. Rah, 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 rah. Thanks for all the hard work. We really appreciate it. Rah, 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 rah. Oh, you're going to leave this time. Well, that makes sense, because I don't have a clock to set. <laughs> you should go see your new room upstairs, LB. Dad even brought a new clock for it to help ce celebrate the big move. It better not be set. He better have already set it. What? What? But my clock's right there. It's 10.56 in the morning. Okay, whatever. The movies is on in TV. Two men, big. Yeah, better get going. Wasn't that just? Quit smelling the freaking. Do you love smelling a Zuril or something? <laughs> okay. Wow. It's a Lapras doll. And no, I. Why are you looking at the Lapras doll? I want to look at the mats. Okay. I guess I can't look at the mats.
uh... <laughs> what? <laughs> the clock on the wall isn't moving. You've got to set the time! Wait, are you really serious here? The hour hand was set to 10 and the minute hand to 57. Okay. Cute. How do you like your new- How do you like your new room, LB? Good! Everything's put away neatly. Well, have fun! I'm gonna sleep on the couch. They finished moving everything in downstairs, too. Well, did they just leave? It really is not so nice having Pokemon around to help us. Oh! But you should make sure that everything's all there on your desk. <laughs> Alright, LB's notebook is full of adventure rules. She jotted down. Yeah. Yeah. And that's everything. Where's my computer? It's a Wii U! It has a gamepad with the screen! Yeah! Wait. That's not yours! Or that's not mine. I have a black one. What are you talking about? I'm gonna be playing Super Smash Brothers later. Yeah, um, I will be p recording this until about 8 o'clock tonight, and then I'm going to, uh, head out to pick up Super Smash Brothers, so that's something to keep in mind. Oh, LB, LB, quick, come quickly. Yeah, that must be hard to say. LB, 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 LB. <laughs> it's the Pedalberg Gym? Maybe Dad will be on TV. We brought you this live report from in front of the Petalberg Gym. Next up, a special look at a long-awaited meteor shower in the next star show. <laughs> you missed it. You must suck a lot. Shut up. Oh, it's already ended. Looks like your dad was on, but we missed his part. Well, he did say we suck at missing it, so... I think he probably he probably said it and then cut to that immediately just to rub it in everyone's face if they weren't looking. What a shame, yeah. <laughs> but that reminds me, one of Dad's friends lives in this town. Professor Birch is his name. He lives right next door, so you should go over and introduce yourself. All right. What the heck's this? Looks like Mom jotted something down. There are notes about tonight's dinner plans. Well, I'm not going to be here for tonight's dinner, so... <laughs> uh. You're not a fat guy now. You're like... Well... Not... He's a little overweight, but he's more like an adult now. Compared to being a little... Or being what looked like a small fat guy. Um, wow, this place looks, it's a serious looking machine. I remember when that just looked like a round machine and I was like, what the heck is that? Hmm, cool. Okay, let's, let's get the story on the, mo on the go because I want to beat this and I'm going to be, I'm going to be up a lot these next few days. Oh, hello, and you are... Yes, my name is Dot Dot Dot. That's what I should have named myself. Dot Dot Dot. Oh, you're LB, our next new our new next door neighbor. Welcome. We have a son who's just about the same age as you. He has been so excited about making a new friend. He should be in his room upstairs. I hope you'll get, go and introduce yourself. Yeah, plus, isn't Brendan supposed to be more like the battle style? Unless they change the dialogue like they did in X and Y, where they made the male look like a douche and the female not so much like a douche. Man, those moving... What are you doing? <laughs> are you doing that with by yourself? Or what? Pokemon fully restored, items all packed, and... You? S surprise eyes? Who are you? LB? 
Oh, you're the new kid who just moved into next door. I'm not a kid. We're gonna be rivals now for calling me a kid. Huh. I didn't know that you'd be a girl. Thought we were gonna be bros. <laughs> bros, not not sis and bro. From another mother. Shut up, Luke. Dad, I I mean Professor Birch told me you were the kid of the gym leader. And I sort of hoped you'd be a guy. Wow. Wow, just way to put it out there. I'm right here. Except I'm actually a guy playing a girl that actually seems kind of weird saying it now that I say that. <laughs> yeah, it does. My name's Brendan. Well, I guess we are still neighbors, so... Nice to meet you. Let's be friends, okay? Huh. Hey, LB? Don't you have any Pokemon? If you want, I can go catch one for you. Nah, I got plenty in Pokemon Bank! <laughs> oh wait, I forgot! I'm supposed to be going out to help my dad catch some wild Pokemon! Some other time, okay? Yeah, it makes it makes it easier being the girl because I can voice act a freaking guy, too. <laughs> my normal voice. Funny enough. Trash Yeah, I'm checking I'm checking the neighbor's trash. Does he have any notes of his own? This'll be on the test, don't forget it. Each Pokemon can learn up to four moves? Yeah, we already know this stuff. See, look! The guy has a black Wii U! See, he is like, a, like me. So it's a good thing that I actually am being the girl for voice acting him. Because otherwise I'd be doing this all game. Yeah, that's no fun at all. Okay. Hey, kid! What's going on? Spin down in front of him. That looks... That looks totally not... Uh... That looks totally okay in my book. It's not like it looks like you're... Yeah. I think I hear someone screaming up ahead. What should I do? What should we do? Somebody has to go help. Yeah, that looks... Okay. <laughs> I don't need to say anything else. <laughs> Help me! <laughs> nah, you can go to handle it yourself. Yeah, um... I like how it looks more ferocious. Because it's not in 2D, obviously. <laughs> Hello! You over there! Please, help me out! In my bag, there's some balls! Nope. <laughs> Where are you going? Don't me leave me like this! Nope. <laughs> okay. I was going into the, the grass to catch a, a Pokemon, actually. The choice that matters the most. Not really. Um, so, I said to myself I would pick Mudkip. Because I like, no. Um, because obviously we got a Torchic from the one game. Or from, uh, from what is it? Uh, Pokemon X and Y as the event Pokemon. And then Trico. Eh. So, I'm just going to pick Mudkip. <laughs> All right, go Mudkip, and let's take him out. And I forgot to actually go through the options, so um, yeah, we're still gonna get be given the water move right off the bat, like an X. So it's fine by me. Use Water Gun to take it out really quick. Actually, that didn't do as much as I'd hope. Okay, now use Water Gun to take it out quick. There we go. Ah. Whew. 
I went into the tall grass to survey wild Pokemon when I was suddenly jumped. You saved my hide, kid. Thanks a lot. I'm not a kid. Oh? But you're Norman's girl, LB. I didn't even realize who you were at first. You've grown into quite the young lady. This isn't the place for a chat, though. Come along to my lab. And then we're just t teleported into Little Root, as that it, as said by the bottom screen. So, LB, I've heard so much about you from your father, but he said that you don't have your own Pokemon yet. If that's true, that was quite the performance back there. Wait, how do you not have a Pokemon? You're this, you're the daughter of a gym leader. <laughs> Looks like you really are your father's daughter, though, from handling those that wild Pokemon with another person's Pokeball. Yes. Oh, yes, yes, yes. <laughs> to say thanks for rescuing me out there, how about I give you that Pokemon you used earlier? Jeez, don't say yes or no, just... Just... Give it to me. While you're at it, why not give a nickname to that Mudkip? If I was doing a Nuzlocke, I would say yes, but since I do not know... If anything, leave a comment, and I will nickname the Mudkip whenever we uh, get to the Name Raider. How about that? That's a good one. Um, same thing with any other Pokemon, actually, that I catch. Oh, so that's how you like things to do. Or, that's how you like to do things? Not even going to give it a nickname, are you? That's an insult to all Pokemon! Didn't you just hear me? I just said to let the comments do it. And I don't want any curse names through the which obviously I can't do because of blocks, but yeah, don't try to filter block nickname or whatever. <laughs> you know, if you work with your Pokemon and gain experience, I think you'll make a pretty excellent trainer. My boy, Brendan, happens to be out on Route 103, right now, surveying Pokemon for me. It might not be a bad idea for you to head out that way yourself. What do you think? No, I want to get on with the story. Oh, don't be that way! Man! You're, you're a freaking... What are they called? Rebel. You're a rebel these days. <laughs> Come on, you should go be meet my kid. No. Fine. <laughs> Great. I'm sure Brendan will... I've never even seen... Ill before in a Pokemon game or whatever. Be happy to hear that too. He can help teach you what it means to be a trainer. Oh yes! <laughs> and if you're ever lost... If you ever lost along the way, just use the area nav on your PokéNav Plus down there. You can use it to see how to get to Route 103, where Brennan should be. And if you or your Pokemon get tired, get some rest back at your house. Your new house. <laughs> your new 3D house. <laughs> okay. So apparently... Okay, I can't sneak. Boop, 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 boop. No. No. Okay, so... I'll record it a little longer. Maybe try to get through... Well, that wasn't long. Maybe try to get through the, uh... This little story part where, like, by the time we get back to the lab, that's when I will probably in this video or something. Come on, kill it in one hit! Or don't. Ow. One thing about using water Pokemon on an island region, it's a lot of water. So, not not 7.8 worth of water, <laughs> but a lot of water where my Mudkip might not come in handy whenever I'm out surfing and battling water trainers, obviously. Yeah, cool. Cool, kid. See, you're a kid. You have 
You're freaking small. Hey, what are you doing, kid? I'm gonna sneak up to you. <laughs> My Pokemon jump out when you walk in tall grass. Yeah. Get out of the grass without getting caught in a Pokemon battle. That's how you do it. <laughs> oh, hey, kid. I work at the Pokemart. From what I can see, you're a novice trainer. Am I right? No, I got a, I got a live Dex in my frickin' Pokebank. What the hell are you talking about? Being super kind-hearted as I am, I'm going to give you a, some useful advice. Yes. They reverted back to separating the Pokemarts from the Pokemon Centers. First of all, there's a Pokemart over there. Just look at the blue roof. We sell a variety of goods, including Pokeballs, for catching Pokemon. Do you have any right now? I'd like to have the- I'd like you to have these as part of a special promotion. Potions? Wow. Way to handhold there, Nintendo. <laughs> Potions can be used anytime, so they can be very useful to have. And this right here is a Pokemon Center. I think you know what it is. It's the one with the, roo the red roof and there's a woman inside. <laughs> But you're a girl, so don't if you hit on her. No. Just have a great journey. <clears throat> okay, so what's it look like in here? Wow. Hey! Nurse Joy! What happened to the staircase? Or the escalator? Man, they really downgraded this Pokemon Center when <laughs> it doesn't have that, and I did not want to do that. What? A Pokemon journal? Are you serious? Well, first, I forgot to do this. Um, options. Fast. Battle effects on. Battle style switch. Set. Button mode default. Forced save. Oh. Wow, it's true! People said that there weren't, uh... There wasn't any way to customize the bottom screen, and yeah, there isn't any way to customize the bottom screen in a Pokemon battle. Wonder why they did? They just didn't reuse the same ones as the last game, but whatever. Um, yeah, yeah, I'm not gonna read all your dialogue because you're just an NPC. I'm just, I'm just clicking to see if you give me anything. Nope. Yes, I like to get my one Pokemon healed. At least I can see the Pokemon on the screen. Before, you could barely see them on Pokemon X and Y. So, that's a good thing. You got anything in here? I'm a thief! Give me your stuff! You don't have anything. Why does everyone have a journal? Apparently, I can't even read the journal. <laughs> I guess that would be an invasion in their privacy, but who the heck cares about that? It's a Pokemon game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nothing. Nothing. This town is poor. It's old and... Ah! Uh, wait! Please don't wander around here! There are footprints! Don't you see them? I've just discovered a set of incredibly rare Pokemon prints. Wait until I finish sketching them, okay? Ah, uh, dude. Those are round. Like, not, those don't look like Pokemon footprints, but whatever. I'll let you see to it, I guess. Okay. Yep, I kind of figured as much. Yep, this Pokemon is very, very poor. Freaking out of Pokeballs. What kind of Pokemart runs out of Pokeballs? Yeah, potions. Yay. Okay, so let's continue onward and upward. Don't get a hit. I want to... Yeah. Yeah, cool. 
Professor Birch's 101 book? Wow, I thought Professor Oak was... When in the old version, this comes out into the grass so you have to actually walk? Whatever. Wow! That, like, look at that background right there. It's, it's like, it's photoshopped on there or something. It's like a copy-paste. The mountains look so fake. The leaves look okay, but the gra- the mountains. <laughs> okay, so it's this one and that one that live in ra on Route 103. Yeah, Swingle and Poochiena? Or Zigzagoon? Yeah. Huh? Hey, LB. Oh! So you finally got a Pokemon from my dad? Then how about we settle it in sma- No, in a little battle. Since we're here and all, I'm going to teach you what being a Pokemon trainer is all about. Yeah! Okay. Did you just smile at me and you went bling? Really? <laughs> okay, let's see how this goes, because watch me fail, because... I didn't level you up enough, and, uh, Trico has a grass move. Ooh, that did a lot of damage, actually. Keep, keep doing that. Yeah, and you keep doing that, because... <laughs> Boom, baby! Yeah! Give me that level 7, too. But no w learning water gun, because we already got that. Huh! You're not too shabby, LB! <laughs> that face! It was a good battle. Thanks! Here, let me heal both your our parties real quick. Didn't do that in, in third generation, that's for sure. Hand holding. <laughs> I think I know why my dad had his eye on you now. Look, just you just got your Pokemon, right? And you already have that strong of a bond? I get that feel the feeling that you could be friend any Pokemon LB, no doubt. Well, I've got some good data here, so I guess it's time to head back to the lab. You should head back too, LB. Okay, so once I end the video, I'm gonna start rendering and I'll probably level up Mudkip a little bit more, maybe to level 9 or something. And. Oh, oh okay. I'm heading back. To my le dad's lab first. Come on, LB. Yeah, I think you already claimed that. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna level it up a little more, and then the next video, I'm going to actually try, try, try transferring Steelix into my game because I should get my Pokédex now, and that should get me the chance to do that. So, oh, LB, over here. So I hear you beat my Brendan on your first try. Amazing! Brendan has been helping me with my research for a long time, so he has a pretty long history as a trainer already, even though he has a level 5 Pokemon. Mm-hmm. I think that settles it. LB, I ordered this Pokedex for my research from Professor Oak. He just loves handing those things out. <laughs> but I think you should take it. That Pokédex is a high-tech tool that automatically makes a record of any Pokémon you meet or catch. My boy Brendan <laughs> takes his with him everywhere he goes. Whenever he catches a rare Pokémon and records its data into the Pokédex, why, he comes to seek me out whenever I am in the field 
and show me the Pokemon and people you will meet and the great expanse of nature that lies before you. Experience them both while you fill in your Pokedex. I'd love it if your world seemed wider than ever. Though I'd love it even more if you came back from time to time to show me what progress you've made. Ah! I'm getting the itch to get out and do field work again. <laughs> huh. So you got a Pokedex too, LB. Well then, here. Have some Pokeballs on me. <laughs> you can catch. You can use them to catch wild Pokemon. Yeah, didn't they start doing this in fourth generation? <laughs> if you catch a wild, if you catch a Pokemon in the wild and battle together with it for a while, it'll grow. It will grow stronger for you. Take that as a bit of advice from a more experienced trainer like me. Yes, because I'm the best. I'm going to get ready to head out for, from Little Root myself. It's like, I don't know. It really gets you pumped, right? Both gotta give it our all out there, LB. Alright, so let's leave and actually... Now that I think about it... I love how... Oh, is this mom? Yeah. Forgot to say bye, mom! Sorry! LB! LB! Did you introduce yourself to Professor Birch? Oh! What an adorable Pokemon! Even though I do not actually see it, it's just in a Pokeball. So what an adorable ball you got there! You got it from prof the Professor? How nice! You are your father's child, alright. You look good together with a Pokeball. Pokeball! <laughs> to think that you have your very own Pokemon now. Your father will be overjoyed. But don't push yourself too hard. If anything happens, you can always come home, honey. Honey. Bye! I think that was the time where she was supposed to give you the running shoes, but yeah. <laughs> what? Now? <laughs> Jeez! This is from da Dad. He said... He forgot to give it to you before. Finally! Dex Nav function has been added to your PokéNav Plus. The app I just added to your PokéNav Plus is called the Dex Nav. It can tell you lots about Pokémon living in each area and that kind of stuff. It's a handy app if you ever try to catch lots of different Pokémon. Guess it's about time I use the Dex Nav to do a little more catching myself. I'm gonna head that way and see what I can find. LB, you should use those Pokeballs I gave you earlier to do a bit of catching, too. Yeah. Hmm. Maybe I will catch one. Uh, let's see. Well, I see Poochian and Wormble. Okay. What the heck are you doing, Brendan? Hey, LB! Over here! See that? Right there? There's his tail sticking out. That's what I was trying to do, but I guess you gotta do this first. There's a Pokemon hiding there! And look here. If you check the Dex Nav... Score! Looks like that Pokemon knows a pretty rare move, too! Called an Egg Move! Sweet! LB! Try getting closer. Real nice and slow. Push lightly on the circle pad to sneak close to a Pokemon hiding in the grass. That's what it said in some book. I don't know what, but some book. I'm just gonna keep talking to you as it shakes its butt at you. You're almost there! Slowly. Slowly! Remember, you press lightly on the circle pad to sneak. Okay, let's see how rare this move is. Whoa, it's a freaking level 5? Can you catch even higher level Pokemon than normal? Because I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be 
two to four or something. Bam! Ooh, one more hit and that'll... Oh, damn! <laughs> I was not expecting, uh... I was not expecting a fire fang to the face right away. Just don't do a critical. If you do it, good. Just keep using fire fang. Yeah, watch it bar me instead of flinch me. Because <laughs> I know it's got a chance to flinch or burn. Watch it be the stupid burn. Jeez, ten? I thought it was five. Yeah. Gotcha. All right. Who? Cool. Nice. Times encounter two. At first sight, Puchina takes a bite at anything that moves. This Pokemon chases after. Her. Yeah, I'm not gonna read all that. Although I find it funny, I've always found it funny that um, Pokemon Ruby and Sapphire, I believe, was the last uh, gen or the last generation, being the third one, was the last one that had like two pages of details, and now it's just one page. So, no. Again, name Raider, let me know. Comments below. Um, and yeah, let's get out of this grass. That was awesome, LB! I've been at this way longer than you, and even I have a hard time sneaking up like that without being noticed. <clears throat> Alright, so we are here. I'm gonna end it here, and I will have a little bit of training, and next time you see me, I'm going to have a Steelix. Because again, Japanese version, not, 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 uh, English, so I get the Steelix that a lot of people would probably want to see. But I, unless, of course, I need to get farther in the game, I'll let you know in the next video if I get it or not. You'll see the title being Steelix, so yeah. Um, but yeah, with that, have a great day, and I will catch you all next video, which should be up later today, actually. I don't know how late, though, so yeah. Depends on how quick I can render these.